What up? My name is Frank Murr. What the fuck? Hey, pussy, are you still there? That's fucking illegal. Shut the up, Dave. Dustin's little pea head is gonna get removed. Ten more times. I'm not impressed by your performance. Excited about I'm this excited three about matchup. This. Inside the octagon, and Joe's wearing the hat. No, I, honestly, Good. I just want to compete. You guys still with me here? Think the guy needs to have a balls, no? He's showing incredible flexibility in his bones, Joe. That's it, fuckers. Welcome to the UFC training center. Good luck. Charles Toyn, I don't even know your name, man. Get out. Wow, you got Frank Shamrock. You can Frank Shamrock my balls. Get your together, I'm waiting for you. Frank Murr. Frank. Frank Murr. Did you guys bring this? Dana was pissed. Just standing there pissed. Anderson Silva, you absolutely suck. This is Joe Rogan doing play-by-play -play of ice yeah, being spilled ice. inside. <laughs> Dude, you suck yesterday. Where were you? Inside leg kick is there for Shogun. Maybe a slip there, Shogun. Excuse me. What the I... fuck you doing here? It's not Christmas yet. Dana, I want you to say one nice thing about Randy. Fuck you, Randy. Do you think GSP is on the juice? <laughs> Flintstone vitamins. 10 million strong and fucking illegal. Oh, how tall are you, buddy? Five foot nine. All right, I'm five six. You're five four at least. Three, three inches taller than me, buddy. <laughs> I'm good. And you're starting a fight with uh, Santa Claus. Fuck Santa. You should stand up because we can barely yeah. see you on the screen. <laughs> yeah, all right. I am a gangster. <laughs> Jones put his finger in his eye. Dirtiest fighter in the <laughs> They're chanting, fuck you, Sarah. <laughs> and I'm thinking, this is a fucking horrendous start to this fight. Uh, I want to be alpha male tonight. Can I party with you guys after the fight or what's up? <laughs> how tall are you? <laughs> uh... I don't know how many times I had to tap his leg. Mazzagatti was a dickhead. He should be thrown out of the arena. I don't have much left to say other than you have seen nothing yet. <laughs> oh, y'all got carrot cakes and stuff up there now, man? Yeah. She. Oh, y'all got pecan pop in this motherfucker, too. So can we get his thoughts on, on what he thinks of Nick Diaz not showing up today? What? Did Nick know he's here? I don't know uh, Frankie Signs. Because you don't know fighting, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's Frankie Signs. Ah, the Iceman can throw. <laughs> you know, I, I have a feeling there's a little red light, so the boys know when they're on camera. Two beat trap, Nate, back to two nine. That's when they hurt. The referee, that's their moment where they're in the spotlight right there. Are you going to do something? Mario Yamasaki said, fuck it. I'm going to spread yeah, love. Fuck it. Fuck it. Yeah, you like yeah. California so far? Uh, not particularly, no. Uh, I'm a Dublin man. I love my hometown. But, uh... <laughs> not a GSP fan, huh? Yeah, no, uh, uh, it... my mom is. <laughs> yeah, I bet she is. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I would choose that camera guy right over <laughs> You know, Hector yeah, Lombard yeah, yeah. slams a motherfucker Crazy. down when he sprawls on you. <laughs> it's the scariest sprawl I've ever seen. Yeah. Like, when he snapped down Tim Bosch, it was like, bitch! Man, I don't like Hector, dude. He still hasn't, he hasn't responded to my challenge of uh, the wrestling match, and he's still alleging that he beat me. We, we have Hector here right now. Right here on the, oh, on the show! Hector! Shut up! 
Man, that judo. It's hard to learn those kamikaze. <laughs> like, Hector, do you think you could beat Ben Askren? I beat him. Uh, how would you beat Ben Askren? I slap him in the face. <laughs> I, I take him down. <laughs> Fucking idiots. He wants to wrestle. I wrestle him. I slap his face. I, I hit him on his ball and send him home. Cry to his mind. I think my relationship with GSP is right there. As the rock says, know your damn role, yeah? <laughs> this is the UFC. This is real life. We get in and we fight. It ain't no fake shit. He's not exactly killing it as uh, as you would think he was by the way he talked. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> And Chuck having some fun as he knows he is live. Is it possible that that beard could absorb punishment? No, no. no. Is it possible? No. Nah. No? Otherwise, Kimbo slaps me the no. champ. <laughs> I posted about the Q&A on Monday saying I would be too chicken to ask you a question. I called you a pussy, I remember. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yes. Good at math. <laughs> I still kick your ass, man. I'm not on steroids, man. I don't Never think that. I don't think you're life. scared of anybody, bro. I don't. We'll see if they test who for steroids or what. For your first offense, fuck you. For your second offense, fuck you. And finally, for your third offense, fuck you so hard. It's like fuck you, you criminal. The Lakers won their third championship the other day. I couldn't care less. If they made basketball illegal, it wouldn't even bother me. I, I don't like other sports. They're boring to me. Everything else pales in comparison to the excitement of mixed martial arts fighting. I'm the real champion. Wait! Am I doubles all I need for MMA? Frank Mir, you're mine! Let's go! <laughs> you gotta be on the fast track. You That's can't... a good Malago impression. Well, you yeah, did perfect. Yeah. From holding on to the leg, let's go of it, and spins with an elbow that just drops. Look at Joe Silva's face. <laughs> what? I wish I could see that same angle again. I want to see Joe Silva's face again. Denver is a cool place, man. I, I went to the zoo and hung out in the zoo. I made a friend at the zoo. Little monkey looked like little John Jones. I was, I was, he was pop locking and everything. I was, you know what I'm saying? He even had the pubic hair on his face just like Jones. I was like, man, you know? It was a cool little monkey, you know? I like Denver. I'd be bad. And it was like one of those second or third fights when there's nobody in there, you know? And also, they're like the ref, Steve Levine. All of a sudden, he's like, Eve Levine, fuck you! <laughs> like, how the fuck do you feel after that? Like, <laughs> what do you, and you gotta stand there and take it, like, fuck you! And you're like, okay, you know, fight, what the fuck? UFC 10, uh, my manager held up three Gracies in one night, and uh, they weren't happy about it. Uh, Hensel, he tracked me down literally, and he said, three Gracies one night, Coleman? Well, how about one, and we start right now, and, uh... Hey, Connor, Connor, do you know what wrestling is? I can, I can rest my balls on your forehead. Oh, wait, uh, oh, Gilbert won, so... Fuck, fuck you, Eddie. Thank you, Nate. Barry really did look like he was like, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> and then he started getting hit. Getting all crazy. <laughs> Looks like Clay Guida. <laughs> Giant Clay Guida. And Art, isn't it true that you didn't even know he could take you down? To be a boxer, I had to stay on my feet. Yeah. And again, Hoist did the smartest thing, you know? He came and he took my legs up under me. I looked up at the referee like, you know, all right, I'm ready to get up. He's like, no, keep fighting. <laughs> and then, the, the funny part is, Hoist head busted me three times. Bam, bam, bam. I said, he's cheating. He says, no. <laughs> it was a really bad night for me, okay? So, so. 
Tinov's probably been leg locked a million times in his life. <laughs> you know, look at him. See, look at see what I'm saying. He's yeah, waving. Exactly. I mean, this guy is not worried about being heel hook or leg locked. Look at that. This is a man who thinks he's just won the fight. Yeah. The strangling that you're talking about has already taken place. Oh wow. We have photographic evidence on Joseph's phone. I I strangled him. We've settled our differences. He's apologized. He's turned down a fight with my son. Um, <laughs> And um, we're good now, we're good. He's okay, he knows his place. Uriah Faber runs over to me, starts screaming at me about him getting hit after the belt. Get up here, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing? All right. You're a grumpy motherfucker. Thanks, Anna, appreciate it. Grumpy Merry motherfucker. Merry Kwanzaa, right? Other people think he's a dick, but, uh, you know, I have no opinion of him, really. But uh, what I want to do is I want to announce the winner of the Josh Koscheck Photoshop competition. We have the pictures here. I'm sure you guys will be impressed. Cost you, this is what the fans think you should do to your hair. Me personally, I love your hair. Oh, look. That's ridiculous. It's Edgy Bra, also known as Eddie Bravo. <laughs> oh. Edgy Bra. That's what they Edgy. thought when we were in Brazil. That's what they called me, Edgy. And you have to sit there and listen to him call out everyone's name. Oh. And I'm sitting there, I'm waiting for him to call my name. He goes, he, look, he looks at the clipboard, then he looks up and goes, Hey, Jibra! <laughs> I'm standing right in front of him. I'm standing right in front of him. I'm like, man, when are they going to call my name? <laughs> hey, Jibra. Hey, Jibra. <laughs> I'm like, fuck. And then someone say, dude, I think he's saying your name. This is Ben Funky right. Aspirin. Please leave me a message, and I'll Another get one. back to you. Hey, Ben, this is Hector Lumba. I kick your ass. If you are satisfied with your what message, happened? Press one to listen to your message. I got pushed Press the two to erase and re-record. Press three to continue recording where you left off. Press four. Answer the phone, you bitch. You Can I uh, wrestle your Rogan? And if I win, you come to Sweden. Huh? Sure, get up here, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Just take a look. It's in our book. Reading Rainbow. <laughs> Enjoying the journey the whole time. Like I'm a kid in Disneyland. <laughs> buying a Christmas present for Jesus and giving a high five to God. Mama Babo, how you say that name? <laughs> Fabio Maldonado. So it can spring to life and become food for the land. And now interrupt his opponent. Oh, no, my friend, my God, I am uh, a fucking mess. I hate this. <laughs> this is my last fight. Tabernacle colors. I am done. I can't stand this shit. Paint your face up like Mike Tyson. Gain 100 pounds. Sit in the second row and talk about when you meant something to the world because your time has passed. Welcome to 2000 and Chael. What did you think about him wearing a ponytail into the ring? Hey, I appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> One of the greatest fights in UFC history. They didn't even show this on the air, so this guy, I'm not going to mention his name, on the show, he lost, and you can drink all the alcohol you want in the house. All of a sudden, this guy gets super racist in the house, and there's a bunch of black guys in the house. Starts talking about how his wife loves him because the Aryan nation, and starts throwing up racial slurs and throwing up these, you know, the hit, hey Hitler stuff. I'm sleeping. I have the biggest fight of my life the next day, and I thought it was a dream. Kimbo Slice uh, comes in my room, and they go, yo, shop, get up, dog. Get up, man. I'm like, huh? Why are there three large black guys around my bed? Kim goes, yo, man, this dude's down there talking about our people. We're about to jack him up. I Literally, I thought I was in a dream. I go, excuse me? He's talking about our people, dog. Let's go F this dude up. But you realize I'm not black, right? Kim goes, you ain't black? I go, <laughs> no, man. He goes, damn, that's crazy. <laughs> Turn around, leave, and I hear, that's why lock shop. You can't tell what the hell he is. <laughs> keep going. And then I, then I... <laughs> is there any chance of bringing back Pride Rules for a Japanese guard? Who did you say? Pride Rules. Paid Rules. Pride Rules. Pride. You're... <laughs> Pride Rules. You're killing me over there, Braveheart. Uh... <laughs> That dude looks like Anderson. That, that is Anderson. Anderson. And Anderson you know can do whatever the fuck he wants. He can do whatever he wants. Silver. He's in Rio. They can yeah. suck each other's dicks exactly. right now. <laughs> the whole crowd will go, whoop, my <laughs> He well, really is. When a guy's fight, no one ever says, yeah, well, I'll fucking slam a basketball on you. You know? Because <laughs> no one cares. Fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you more. I titty fuck you. 
uh, you know I didn't say a word because I don't I didn't want to cry. <laughs> Straight up, for real. I was like I I felt like if I would say I'm like you know what man and I, just tears would start coming down. <laughs> <laughs> Any other kids in here? <laughs> This is James Tom reporting for this goddamn station, whatever it is. I'm out of here. 146 pounds! ...to train at Team Alpha Male, but he's wondering, is there a height restriction? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, 5'9", you're pushing it. <laughs> okay. Using the human cockfighting analogy, you know... No, the guys all wear pants. They're really... <laughs> I said that once to an ESPN reporter, kind of shut the thing down. He goes, is this human cockfighting? No, they're all got, they all have pants. They all have pants. There's <laughs> two of the toughest fighters in the world will spend 25 minutes in the ring, and neither one of them leave with a scratch or a bruise. Get in there and fight one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Not me, man. I call that mixing your punches up. <laughs> yeah. tell, tell John Wayne Parr about John, that. <laughs> John, that's called mixing your punches up, John. Why do you uh, subtitle Aaron Wilkinson on the Ultimate Fighter <laughs> and not GSP? <laughs> In all fairness, we subtitled James Tony as well. <laughs> <laughs> Travis Brown, thank you for that beard. I just feel like he should stand on the front of boats. John, uh, you're a freaking inspiration. I love you, man. But like Kanye West, it is hard to be your fan. <laughs> what, <laughs> what a... It's hard to be, man, I do some dumb stuff, don't I? <laughs> Jeez. Never seen anything like it in my life. A naked guy just lying there. I bet on Ferreira. Did you really? These motherfuckers are gambling. <laughs> Diego. <laughs> that UFC MMA shit, then, then you gotta sleep what she says to sleep. She's gonna come at you, well, let's get you in her armor. All right, all right, all right. Tap it out. Or she chokes you out. You wake up on the couch like 11 minutes later, like. <laughs> Just grab your jacket off the back of the couch. I fucking hate when she does this. <laughs> Have a debate like a normal person. Is this in Africa? <laughs> Where are we? <laughs> Hey, I'd say well, it's, uh, it's close. It's really almost even fucking, money. That's a yeah. big spread, actually. Hey, minus one twenty. It's What's a up, really Doug? good fight. Thousand bucks. I got Carter. You got Aldo. Oh my goodness! What is going on? Eddie Bravo <laughs> became some crazy thousand dollar gambler. <laughs> but the thing that he You're said to Andy him. Andy Dick. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. man. I was on a sitcom guy. with him. That guy is nuts. What happened with you and him? He came. Is he openly gay? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's a secret. Oh, no. But he was like, yeah, oh, he's saying on. some absurd stuff to me. And he starts like coming on to me like hard. And then he's like, uh, he's like, I'm like, like saying stuff. I thought he was joking. And, and then he's like, he says, how old are you? And he's like, starts chasing me around the room. He's like taking a piss. I'm like, whoa, whoa, look at that. His, like pants fall down. I'm like, what the hell is going on with this guy? <laughs> so I was like, I just fucking beelined out of there and was like, <laughs> but he's got. After this is done, I'm gonna look back and say, man, you know, maybe talking to my kids or maybe just a drunk down at the beach saying, hey, I used to be world champ. They're like, shut up, old man, get out of here, you know. And I'm like, no, I was, I was the best at one time.